If you choose, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You've had a great start to your morning so far. I'm Maria Corpus. And I'm Justin Scroggins for Fort Atkinson News Network. These are the morning announcements for Friday, February 5th, 2010. Hey there, Blackhawks. There is still time to order a 2010 yearbook at the low price of $40. Books will be sold during course selection on Monday. See Mr. Euling or Ms. Lindy at the English department table to reserve your copy. After the completion of the sale, the price will go up. Also, a representative from UW-Whitewater will be in the guidance office today at 1235. If interested, please sign up in Pupil Services. I'm definitely going to check that one out. I might as well. The UW-Madison School of Pharmacy is hosting a discovery day for high school students on Saturday, March 13th. This program is designed to provide high school juniors and seniors information about pharmacy-related careers. Advanced registration is required. Stop in Pupil Services for more information. Also, juniors and seniors, the monthly calendar for February has been posted on to the high school website under the Pupil Services link. Each month, the Pupil Service staff prepares a monthly calendar of activities, scholarships, and opportunities to attend workshops, college visits, camps, and conferences. Stop in Pupil Services for a copy or visit the website. Roses are red, Fort TV is sweet, have we got a deal that can't be beat. Joining our fund to raise some dough, buy a soda for someone you want to know. Orange, red, purple, the colors of choice, each color reflecting a certain voice. So look for our table at lunch next week and reserve your refreshment for those that you seek. This is a Fort TV fundraiser. Each week on Fort Atkinson News Network TV, we will be bringing you a segment that focuses on something unique, interesting in our school. That's right. In our first segment, we wanted to show you all the work and planning that has gone into bringing your own first episode of video announcement. Hey, welcome to the Fan Newsroom, your best source for what's new with your school and you. Believe it or not, but this room a few weeks ago looked nothing like it does today. The planning process for this class has taken probably three years in the, in the making. When I met Chris as a freshman, I had a, a young man who was very interested. It's just one of those things. I was really involved with Fort TV, and I wanted to see more people um, become involved with uh, the actual video making process. came to the idea that we should turn this into a class, and there are other schools in the area that had something similar. So we started that process about two years ago. So we took it to the school district, tried to get a class approved. Three years of work has finally paid off to being able to bring something to students and having students run video announcements. All right, so we're actually in what used to be the old Jedi room right now. This, is, um, this has become the fan TV studio. This room had quite a few cords in it. I mean, literally this whole room was just torn apart. The drop ceiling came out. Chris and I have been putting a lot of work and time into tearing apart this room. Basically inhaled a pound of dust that wasn't very good for our health. And we found a dead mouse, which we then showed to our advisors. Uh, unwired everything in this room and put it back together. And it turned out really nice. Now some of you FAH students out there might be seeing this and asking yourself, Hey, I want to be on TV. Well, here on FAN you can do just that. Say you and your band want to get some recognition. Come talk to us. Club events? Come talk to us. Or maybe you have something that is feature news material and you just want to get it on TV. Come talk to us. We can probably make it happen. We can help get the student voice out there better than ever before. If the process itself is interesting to you, well then come talk to us here at the Fort Atkinson News Network. Each week we'll be bringing you a feature package of stuff that just might interest you. The students, the voice of Fort High. So keep watching. You won't be disappointed. Well, I thought um, auditions were fun. I thought they were pretty nervous. I was very, yeah, I was very nervous <laughs> the whole time, but... <laughs> Me too. 
But look at me now. I know, we got it. Yes, Congratulations wow. to us. <laughs> oh, just a moment. We have just received some breaking news. Apparently Mr. Kemp has just run out of his enormous stash of prunes. If any Fort Atkinson High School student are willing to donate prunes for, to the cause, turn them into Mr. Kemp. <laughs> well, it looks like we are out of time today. So, I will see you guys later. Have a classy day, Fort Atkinson.